Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. Hello friends, welcome back once again. Today I am going to discuss about the Drug Technical Advisory Board. It is a very important topic for your all the former community exams. Drug Technical Advisory Board is a committee which is constituted by the central government and which helps the state government and central government regarding all the pro problems which arises in the administrations of the Drug and Cosmetic Acts. Basically, Drug Technical Advisory Boards consist of 18 members. It have 18 members out of which 8 members came from ex officio five members are nominated member and another five members are elected members so eight five five total 18 members so the number of question time asked that which of the following is the ex officio members of the drug technical advisory board or which is not the ex officio member of the drug technical advisory board DTAB. So I will discuss here all the eight members of the ex officio firstly. First ex officio member. Here first member you have to remember all the three ex officio of the pharmacy council of india are the included here so and one by one i will put here first director general of health services first member second member is the Drug Controller of India and third member is the Director of Central Drug Laboratory and this is situated into the Kolkata. So these three members are the ex officio member of pharmacy council of india now next fourth member director of central research institute and this is located into the kasoli fifth member Director of Indian Veterinary Research Institute and this IVRI Indian Veterinary Research Institute is situated into the Izzatnagar. Next, sixth director of CDRI that is Central Drug Research Institute and this is located in the Lucknow seventh president of PCI Pharmacy Council of India and eighth number is the President of MCI that is Medical Council of India. So these are the ex officio member of the Drug Technical Advisory Board. Next nominated nominated members. Here total is 
five nominated members in this five nominated members first is the two person in charge of drug control in a state in a state nominated by central government well second one here is the one person from pharmaceutical industry nominated by central government one person from pharmaceutical industry nominated by central government two one three now third one here is the two drug analyst nominated by central government so these five members are the nominated member of the drug technical advisory board here third is the elected member elected member are also five and here all the members are individually elected so first member a teacher elected by executive committee of PCI so one teacher elected by the executive committee of the PCI next a teacher elected by executive committee of mci so one teacher from the P executive committee of pci and one teacher elected by the executive committee of mci next a pharmacologist elected by icmr indian council of medical research next fourth one person elected by ipa indian pharmaceutical association and next one person elected by central medical association so these are the five elected members five nominated and eight ex officio so by this you will easily remember this thank you